What's up everybody, Dr. Blankenstein back again. I'm gonna start dropping some new videos. Sorry, I've been kinda of out of the YouTube loop. Been busy getting that gear out for everybody. I got some new prototypes. Gonna be showing off the next month or so. So make sure you subscribe. All right, so here we're looking at the Endeavor Space Line Generator. If you look real closely up here, that's actually a background picture of the Space Shuttle Endeavor. Uh, beautiful picture right there. Nice graphics. You can see the color scheme going on on here. We got our level knob. Three separate sections controlling our baseline. Uh, baseline is being generated with a 10 step sequencer. This will make the pitch higher for that note of the sequence across 10 steps. Up here we have our speed control controlled by the knob. Click the switch. It can be controlled by the light sensor. Same thing with our pitch controlled by the knob. <laughs> Click the switch, light sensor. Filter section provided by the Illumering effect. Turn that sucker on, boom, switch, light sensor. Down here in the bottom we got ourselves eight touch sensors for the most part working in pairs although they do some strange things when you combine them across the board. These two right here are going to change the speed. These two over here are going to change the pitch. These two over here are tied into the voltage of the unit and these two over here are tied into the filter section up here for our effects. Turn key start up front we also got a momentary switch over here and then we have two color changing 10 millimeter leds on the side kind of got like a brush steel kind of look going down the sides um it's our quarter inch input our nine volt power adapter playing with this in momentary uh, would allow you to stutter in some really cool bass lines. Now let's just kick her off nice and plain first. Put in our key. Now I got everything you see set to the same note right now. Okay, so we see have a line kind of starting here. Add a note to that line. All right, turn the volume up. Just the speed. Now 
over here we see we have a shuffle switch. Now the shuffle switch kind of just tied into different spots on the board that I found that kind of glitched out the sequence a bit. So I put that on a rotary switch so you have different selections of how the sequence goes. Does some pretty cool things to the bass line. So, so we get that. Now. now that sounds good by itself, but it really starts to take off the machine when we get the filter section on here. I'm going to show you that now. Now you see that dirtiness gets put into the sound. It really changes up the uh, tone. Now let's work with the light sensors here a little bit. Control the time of the speed. Use them both at the same time. Putting all three of them on here. Thank <laughs> you.